Music isn't purely entertainment, it's also a way of exploring issues such as identity. Artist, academic and author Kiran Tathia decided to focus on the place of South Africans of Indian origin in the broader cultural context. And this inspired a musical project called A Place in Time. Let's take a closer look. The banks of the Vaal River created a tranquil setting for a meeting of minds and creative energy as artist, academic and author Kiran Thathia joined composer, arranger and producer Johan Loss to bring a place in time to life. The album that we put in together is called A Place in Time. And the significance of that is about memories that have been generated over time at specific places. For instance, with Curry's Fountain, the history of Curry's Fountain with the rock concerts. Kieran sought Johan's expertise in audio production. My son suggested, why don't we come and speak to Johan? He's down the river from us. So I said, okay, fine. And I was very nervous. And, you know, Johan's an icon in the music business. He listened very patiently to the five tracks that I chose and said, OK, let's do a mix of these two songs. We chose Curry's Fountain and a song called MTSS Sunday. Within a week or two, I had the two tracks and I was just blown away. I thought, did I write that, you know? It was like mind-blowing. As an arranger, I get a demo recording. Um, and then I start doing an arrangement and I add tracks. But I think in this case, that is just on track for now, but we'll get a real type of player in to come and play the real thing for us, which will be better. Vocalist Videshni Raghavalu was next up to the mic with the song about youth and hope. It's great that we can actually find um, musicians all around South Africa to speak about or to sing about and make music about the places that affected us um, politically and affected society and that actually built society. The song that I'm singing is called Phoenix Rising and it's sort of like a dual concept. Phoenix is in the place, Phoenix. The Phoenix in Greek mythology is rising from dust, rising from nothing and it's, you know, something that becomes fire, becomes light. And that's exactly what the song says, it, it keeps us positive. It's about Phoenix but not in its real state, but more in a mythological state, sort of a more affirming thing. You know, as an artist I think more in visual terms. So I had this picture in my mind of this young child in a school ground, you know, sort of all races in the school ground, sort of just going around like this. And, and that's a sense I wanted to create, an affirming sort of thing. So the line in the song is, I'm a bird in flight. I am a bird in flight. I'm a blinding light. You see me shoot across the sky. It was time for Silas James to take his turn in studio with a song inspired by another evocative place name. The song that I'm singing is called Curry's Fountain. My music journey started, well, when I was seven or eight. My father was a pastor and uh, we used to go for crusades and we used to watch other musicians play and that's how uh, we took up that mantle of music. Heroes play their sports. They put aces through their paces. They had players of different races. I had been to Curry's Fountain as a kid. My dad took us there. We used to sit on this mound and watch soccer. Recently, I visited Curry's Fountain. It's almost nostalgic now. It's like an empty shell of what it was and the importance that it has to the community, not just to the Indian community, but to a broader progressive community. I walked around Curry's Fountain, and that memory of walking around made it easier to write about the place and then and write a song about it. And I went to a concert there with the flames, you know, playing For Your Precious Love. So that's a line in the song, For Your Precious Love. Singer-songwriter Taz Johnston is one of the up-and-coming artists to lend her voice to Kieran's dream. The life we left behind Like the river flowing by The dusty Her involvement in the project has given her a fresh perspective on her own heritage. Growing up, I was not made aware of my heritage and my culture. When I read uh, the song, the lyrics to Cizela, I wanted to know what it was all about. So it actually inspired me to go to Cizela and I made that trip last week. My mind was absolutely blown. I personally love my culture and the fact that I'm part of a project where I get to explore my heritage and share it with other people is amazing. The guys that I'm also working with, Johan, Kieran, Rajesh, Sodhi, I can't even explain how grateful I am to them for getting me into this and mentoring me. Like the 
The actual album is beginning to take shape in Kieran's mind. It'll have 10 or 11 songs and the title track called A Place in Time. There are songs on Linasia, called Streets of Linasia, and the song on Chatsworth as well, Chatsworth Calling. The short-term goal is the, the completion of the album. Much remains to be done before the album is ready for release, but every member of the team is committed to creating a memorable place in time.